Hi folks, Christopher Hobbs here, and I'm in the Redwood Forest right now. It's very still, well, except for the occasional car. A lot of Redwood Oxalis. And as I was going along, I noticed that there is a big turkey tail log right next to the road. And this, these are very, very large fruiting bodies here and masses of, masses of fruiting body. And you can see the, the minute pores on the bottom. This is quite a big piece here. They're all overlapping. And it's Trimedes versicolor, and it's called versicolor because the color can really change to blue, to tan, buff, even yellow. And they're, they're really quite photogenic. And likely one of the most important of the medicinal mushrooms, and they're they're found really literally all over the world. Uh, well, except Antarctica maybe, but they're very common on in the woods. They, they're breaking down dead trees. They're always found growing on dead or down trees, not on live ones. And their job is to recycle them and release the carbon for other organisms. So it's doing its job here and it feels really good. You can peel a little bit off and, and eat it. Harvesting it, they, they come off very easily. These are really in perfect shape here. The minute white pores tells, tells you that it's not a false turkey tail, it's a true turkey tail. And you can take nibbles of it and chew it up and it'll get soft and, and uh, you can chew it while you're in the woods. They certainly are beautiful. And uh, as far as clinical studies for determining how potent they are in clinical applications, like especially in cancer programs along with chemotherapy. There are human clinical trials. Turkey tail are the highest mushroom uh, in, in the fungal kingdom that I'm aware of in beta-glucans, in the immunomodulating beta-glucans, 1316D beta-glucans. And uh, so they are very desirable. You can boil them down. Uh, check out my new book, which is Christopher Hobbs's Medicinal Mushrooms, uh, the, the Essential Guide, and which is out now. And it'll tell you how to make medicines, how to boil it down and make a powder, an extract powder. They have to be heated. And then take it, you can take them every day to prevent infections, to stay healthy during the cold and flu season, and much more. You can even cook them down, make powders, and add it to your soups and, and other dishes. So this is really nice to see. Dramides versicolor. And it's a, it's a really healthy looking patch here. So hope to see you on one of my podcasts or courses. And so get out there and, and take a look. Bye for now.